Up next is Drake Guan. Yes. Hi, everyone. I'm Drake, kind of nervous. I'm coming from KK in Taiwan. So it's quite good to attend this conference uh, the first time and uh, fly kind of such long distance to here. So here is the really short lightning talk. Yesterday, we uh, attended a talk by uh, Fabio Sonnet. That is quite uh, amazing uh, talk sharing about some technology reconstruction perfect, perfect, uh, perceptually uh, video quality. But during the talk, we just realized uh, we might have done some sort of the time machine that Fabio mentioned in Taiwan. That is kind of interesting. So for this lightning talk, I just like to share you the a quick demo video of what we have done, and uh, that's it. So later on, there will be four videos, and three in uh, 740p, and one is in uh, 480p. So you can guess which one is a 480p. Okay. Hopefully it works. All right. Make it bigger. Three seven twenty p and one four eighty p. <laughs> the projector quality might be not good enough. And uh, sorry, it's not big Babani, It's a uh, uh, tears of steel. All right. I can post that here. Okay, later. How to? Okay. So this is what we have, uh, what we have done. Next slide. Okay. So basically, what we are, what we are trying to solve is that uh, bandwidth uh, operation cost. So initially, everyone just focus on the title encoding different codecs, next generation uh, codec. But what we realize is that what we if we can stream in the low quality, uh, low like a uh, SD content video, but perceived just as a HD or even FHD. That's roughly the, the whole idea. So that's why we uh, make this as a perceptual streaming operation system. So overall, the uh, idea and the possible benefits of this idea is that you can see that in the slide. And finally, just show you the result. Hopefully, you can not guess which one. <laughs> so that's the, my talk. Thank you.